Right, anyway, yeah, at least I'm trying. What's your big idea? Haven't got one. Oh, exactly. So you taking your eye off the ball that got us in this mess in the first place. I mean, we were struggling to sell the normal load, and now look. Cos your obsession with Perry, we've got to shift this lot. All right. I'm fully aware this is all my fault. I'm sorry, do you think I'm happy about this? I'm sorry! I'm just scared, Jules. Right, what Victor did to Jordan, I don't want that to happen to me. Or worse. To you. But we need to sell all of this kit tonight, because if we don't... We will. You know, there's not even that much in here. Do me a favour. Stash that somewhere. I don't even want to look at it. You all right? Yeah. Are you? Yeah, I always am. Really? No, I said it's nothing. Maybe if you put that bag down, you'd get the moves right. Or better still, get rid of it altogether. It's not exactly a going out bag. I guess I'm just not into sequins and fake fur. <laughs> well, I think your whole outfit looks great. You'll be in demand tonight. Oh, and I keep meaning to ask, are you and Sis still together? I can never keep up. No, we're not, but we're good. He's my best mate. Well, he's even lucky to have you just as a friend. And Jordan's not coming tonight, so I guess it's just us two. A pair of fitties like you two without a date. Lock up your sons. <laughs> You honestly look amazing. No one could resist you tonight. Don't you look nice? Yeah, I was just, just on my way to Inman's. Yeah, so Jordan tells me. So where's your bag of gear then? Juliet's got it. <laughs> Leave it to the big boys, eh, Sid? Look, we know what we're doing. That's what I like to hear. So, you'll have some good news for me tomorrow then, won't you? I'd expect more confidence from you. So I don't like bad news. Jordan, he's been giving me too much of that lately. We'll sell it all, I promise. You promise? Oh. Well, you know what I did to Jordan. I don't want to have to do that to you or... Juliet. Now, do I? No. Good. I was going to get you flowers to say sorry, but I thought you'd prefer cheesy chips. <laughs> you know, I'm only letting you in because I'm starving. I was just concerned about your bruises. Where did you get them from? I had a run-in with some guy from the past, and I shouldn't have taken it out on you. All right, I'm sorry. So you should be. No, I am trying to do my best for you and Sid, and that's the thanks I get. You're good for getting him into school. Yeah, well, the kid deserves a break, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. I think the world of him, he's... he's loyal, he's resourceful, never gives up. You really care about him, don't you? He's my cousin. Family is supposed to care for each other. But you, that's something different. You know, the kindness of strangers, I can never get my head around it. But I admire it. Done. Uh, cheers for the food, and thanks for helping me with Sid's appeal. Any time. Quite good with words, aren't you? Why don't you go to uni or college or out like that? It's complicated. I'm not sorry for how it worked out, though. Well, it just feels like there's a good brain going to waste. I get to use my brain, don't worry about that. <laughs> I was just rebellious at school. Didn't like people telling me what to do. Oh, I have known a few of them. I mean, it wasn't really me deep down. I was acting the way I thought lads should. That's what happens when you get in with the wrong crowd. And I don't want that to happen to Sid. So, I'm trying to help him. 
That's why the stuff you're doing with them is so important. I kinda wish someone like you would have rescued me. <laughs> you know, I reckon you and Sid will be the new Perry and Tom. What do you mean? You know, even though you're not together, you'll always be really close. It's dead nice when you can keep that. Yeah, well, I would never have put you two together. <laughs> you're so cool. <laughs> And he's... Oh, trust me, that boy's got hidden depths. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Imran's gonna be in trouble tomorrow. Didn't you guys have a thing once? Oh, in his dreams. <laughs> and you're OK about Sid? He'll always be my mate, but... He's not what I want right now. Ooh, why you, you've got your eye on him? <laughs> um, there is someone. 